Good morning, Chasm listeners. This is Candace Teaglin with your conservation report for Saturday, April 13th. We finally received some much needed rain through half of Stearns County, but more rain is greatly needed, especially in the northern half of Stearns County and further north in the central part of the state, according to the newly released drought monitor maps. The sounds of spring are starting to be heard. The sounds of songbirds chirping. The frogs are croaking and some of the insects can also be found flying around. But the one thing you don't see right now are leaves on the trees. It's as if the leaves are in a pause state and they are in no rush to emerge. Hopefully it won't be much longer before all the trees will be waking up from their winter nap. Oh, speaking of trees, did you hear that Stern's SWCD still has plenty variety of trees to purchase for spring 2024 delivery? If you or someone you know is still looking for trees to purchase this spring, check out our website at stearnscountyswcd.net to see current available species. Don't delay on placing an order because our tree store will be closing soon. We are less than two weeks away until we have our tree pickup day. Our tree pickup day will be happening on the last Friday in April, which so happens to also be Arbor Day. So mark your calendars on Friday, April 26, starting at 7.30 a.m. at Rockville County Park. Will be our one day only event to pick up your tree order. If you placed a tree order through our office, look for your green postcard in the mail soon. Did you know that the state of Minnesota proclaims April as Native Plant Month? If that sounds new to you, it kind of is, considering it was recently signed by our governor back in March of 2023. It is not only a state effort, but also a nationwide effort to bring awareness of the important role that native plants contribute to our local ecosystems. If you are looking to plant some native plants, Search no further than our website to find some native trees to plant on your property this spring. Do you or someone you know interested in the weather? Did you know that Stearns County precipitation data is collected by a group of volunteers scattered across the county? The volunteers make it possible to have the collected data for the State Climatology Office to see which areas across the county, and for that matter, across the state, on where precipitation is occurring. The Volunteer Observation Network program monitors and records data on a daily basis if any measurements of precipitation has occurred. Here in Stearns County, we are currently looking for volunteers from any of the following townships. Ashley, Crow Lake, Crow River, Getty, Lake George, Lake Henry, Melrose, Millwood, North Fork, Oak, Sock Center, and Zion. This also includes the cities of Belgrade, Bruton, El Rosa, Freeport, Lake Henry, Melrose, New Munich, St. Rosa, and Sock Center. This program is also open to adolescents with supervision of an adult that can read and report their readings on a monthly form that is submitted to the SWCD office. To learn more about this program, contact our office with further details. I will be happy to assist you. Thanks for listening and have a wonderful day.